I'm over here again at WSM. I didn't have a job over here, but yeah, um, wanted to make. I wanted to see if I had a travel trailer that Wonder Hussy could, Sarah Woodall could use. This is most of the stuff is vehicles. Um, I'm gonna. So you've got if they do have some, you know, some RVs or travel trailers. Now, uh, if she wanted to uh, one of the vehicle four wheel drive, these are all got pretty good rough miles on them. So you do really don't buy one of these. You know, as is, no warranty, so you generally don't buy one of these unless you're a good mechanic or you're, like, married to a good mechanic or have a good mechanic for a girlfriend or boyfriend. Uh, I think there are a few girlfriend, boyfriend, couples that are good mechanics to these. It'd be cool to have a have an old police car. You could uh, make that. Uh, these are on a heavy, heavy chassis. That's a six lug. It's pretty good size. Uh, It's municipal, but you can tell it used to be a cop car. There's a little Suzuki. Oh, uh, to me, they look like a toys. I don't think I'd ever have one. If I gave me one, I'd have fun with it, but I wouldn't pay for one. Well, that's a nice Ford pickup. That's about a one. That's, that's about 450. That's what, two and a half ton or something? 450, that's 350 is one ton. It's usual. You don't see much down here in the way of travel trailers. You see some of the bigger, bigger stuff over there. You see a box truck down there? Hang on, I'm gonna stop this for a sec. Just anything you like, uh, bid on it. I'm not. I'm not going to bid on anything down here because I don't have any money right now. Well, there's a couple of. Uh, I'm going to post those as separate posts. There's a camper. It's an RV. There's a big box truck. That thing's got a flat tire. It's got, that's not the only problem. Engine knock, 4x4. Four four. Chevy. That's one good thing. Ford's a Chevy. Uh, engine knock, runs rough, won't stay running. Well, I'd definitely need to tune up. The tune up means a bit of air in the tire. Uh, Silverado. Yeah, it's crew cab. Pile in, get a handful of guys to drive off to their work site. That's what these are made for. I'm gonna get around that thing because I'm gonna post that as a, as a quick video. I'm gonna I'm gonna put on the I'm gonna put on the on my YouTube channel you know, quickly so I can, so Sarah Jane can see it. I don't take a whole hell of a lot of time editing the videos, but I do. And well, I don't edit them. I just string them together because I don't know how to edit. I just know how to string videos together. Sometimes I'm gonna get good at that editing business, but uh, engine knock. Well, it's a Ford, man. What do you expect? The Ford. I'm just kidding. I've I've had a couple Fords. I've had a, just about everything that's made. I take that back. A bunch of stuff that's made that I haven't had. But I had one, uh, one or two Forfignugans. Yeah, first car I've had was a BW Fastback, 1600 fuel injection. I took the fuel injection off, put put dual, you know, dual carbs on it. There's a Oh man, I wouldn't, ha wouldn't mind having that. Jeep, 2008, KC lights. No way, yeah, I think I'd probably put a winch on there. Get big monster tires. Does that look like inside? Uh, I've got, uh, you can't see it because it's got, uh, yeah. There's some yard art. Havelina. I think it's a baby Havelina. It looks like lions, bear, squish fat turtle. Bunch of, whole bunch of squish fat turtles. I guess somebody likes squish fat turtles. 
There's a Indian. More squid flat turtles. I don't know what that stuff is. It's a bear, it's a bear on top of welcome thing. There's a oh, is that chipmunk? Whatever the hell that thing is. Not and it looks like a fountain. A squish flat turtle. Looks like for a fountain fountain with some blankets and oddball stuff in. There's more of those. Oh, uh, what do we got? Uh, I don't know. Uh, shelving or um uh, oh uh the ninja hoist. I got one little close, close to that. That one's missing the, the, the cylinder. Oh, here, there's a cup holder. These are like if cup holders, like you're going to take it to a bar and want to have a, you know, serve cups to the bar. No, actually, I think that's for, you know, uh, ga gas cylinders. I think that's what it's made for. Uh, what else we got? Got that air compressor has been there for the past six months. It looks like somebody taken it apart. I, I guess nobody, somebody comes out and looks at it and says, well, it's no good and they don't want it. Oh, is that sheet metal brick? What is that? Big spool of steel, steel cable. Tires, bolts. Looks like big industrial dryer, your washers and dryers, big commercial washers and dryers. Is it? Yeah, that's somebody's taking that apart. You can see her. Oh, that's a, well, that's a different one, and because the other one somebody taking apart, but that's, that's been different. Okay, take that back. Please, something do not overfill. Okay. Include these here. What those are made for? Like if you got that neighbor that's playing their music too loud at three in the four, three in the morning, and you don't like it. Uh, you buy one of those and uh, take it and you kind of tell the neighbors to go packing. Well, it's not of me, but I guess not. Tell somebody that works here. You see that thing? You got kinds of like a light bulbs on a overhead <laughs> on the freeway, those ones that uh, require something like that. Anything you got. I had a guy lift me up almost that high on a forklift one time with a little basket and uh, uh, well, I, had to change a, I had to change a light bulb on a fixture. You gotta trust the guy at the controls. No problems, but uh, it's a bit scary. Okay, I'm gonna say bye bye here.